welcome to another PO Box Friday. Um, so I'm here. I'm here with. Um, we're joined by all these fantastic little magnets here. Look at this Gengar, so awesome. Um, and I just wanted to shout out to Nicole, um, who has been fantastic to us for the past past year or so. Actually, um, she discovered our channel and she wanted to sell a few things off, and she gave us some amazing deals. I cannot believe. Um, we got, for example, the Neo Destiny box, a second one which we never thought would be opening again. First edition definitely wouldn't be happening, <laughs> well, you never know. But um, we managed to get that for only 70 bucks. 70 bucks! And I remember wanting to pay her an extra amount as well because I felt really bad because they are valued way, way more now than, than that. Um, so that was that was incredible, and we got loads of more base set boxes because of her, and just and gym challenge as well. So she she made a big impact to our Wizard of the Coast revisit series, which started around about now last year. Um, can't believe it's been a year. What what insanity? Anyway, just a shout out Nicole to to you for being so awesome. Um, we haven't revealed that package that we got from her yet this time. Um, uh, you will have um, seen the little mystery spin to troll video earlier this week um, where I opened a package but you didn't see what was inside silly spinder um, but that was from Nicole so thank you Nicole but we haven't revealed anything just yet so um, you'll have to wait and find out what we're gonna what we have what we have in store for you but for now we've got PO Box Friday so we have got here um, a TCBM from the wonderful Granny HB Dark um, she's so frail, she's as old as a feather. That doesn't make sense. Anyway, that kind of backfired on me. No, I'm kidding. She's really cool. Heather is very, very, a very good friend, actually. Um, and if she ever wins a competition, just so you know, it's not rigged. <laughs> anyway, no, she hasn't won a competition yet, anyway. Well, the major ones. Actually, what have you won from us? Anyway, that's besides the point. Heather is a very good friend of the channel, and um, we've always traded pretty much consistently over the years. So um, always, always such a such a great trader and worthwhile too. Anyway, it says here two PKC. Thanks for an awesome trade as always. Enjoy all these nice reverses, EX Hollow, and shiny cards. Excellent. I can't remember what we traded for to be honest. What we what we have a habit of doing, guys, is that we. Um, generally start putting things aside for each other. I mean, I don't have enough time to trade a lot, but for her I make the exception because I know that, you know, it's going to be so... It's one of those gradual things which don't you don't have to sort of just drop everything and, and go for that. With, with most trades I have to do that because there's just so much involved. But I will open trades up very soon because I do need to complete more collections and I'm sure you guys too, do too. But anyway, um, but basically what we do is we start off and um, we... Um, sort of just um, start putting things aside and then eventually we get to the stage where we're like okay we have enough now we can trade and it makes it so so much more worthwhile and great for postage as well I guess but yeah I don't think there's a note inside so I'm just going to rip this one off there we go. And she told me that she sellotapes it now most of these are going to be reverses from what I know, so let's have a look. So first I have a Hydrogen reverse here from Dragons Exalted. So a lot of these are from Dragons Exalted as well because I do collect the master sets. And there's a Garchomp as well. We also have Gabite reverse. And that's all that we've got on there. I think. Oh no, there's something else in there. Better double check. You never know with her. Okay. It's not gonna. Oh, and, and the other Gabite as well. That's cool. So you guys can see that. Alright, and next. Oops, I'll tape everywhere. Um, what else have we got? We have got. We got a Dino. I think that's the only card in there. Nope, there's another one. Gosh, make it so difficult. I have to take it all out. Might as well keep it out actually. And a rufflet reverse there. Ok, 
Okay, and now we've got Dark Explorers, we have a Leafeon and a Blaziken. Really love that artwork, very, very nice. Um, and there's a start one from Dark Explorers as well, and a Clink Clang, another brilliant, brilliant piece of artwork. We also have a Sandal. Awesome. Reverse there, and there's something else there. And a Clock Rock. That's from Dark Explorers too. Alright. Onwards. Oh, cool! Oh, I forgot I traded for that. Awesome. I was looking for this. Um, the Registeel EX standard normal version. I got the Registeel full art from my first ever box, which is awesome. Um, but this is my f favourite EX from the set for some reason. I don't know. It looks really, really cool. Both full art and um, the regular version. So, thank you very much. Brilliant stuff. Um, Um, from Dragons Exalted. I think there's something in there. Do, 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 do. And a gibble. Cool. Oh gosh. What am I doing? I lost my disorganizing. Oh cool, I needed an, an aggron holo as well. That's one holo I think I was only missing from Dragons Exalted as well, so thank you. Very, very good stuff. There's tapes everywhere. And we have a Murkrow here. Which is a reverse. I wonder what that is. That's weird. Is that like somewhere you can put your name on it or something? Anyway. Ooh. Behind this Mercro from Dragon's Exalted, there's a lighter on from Dragon's Exalted. Excellent. Alright, moving on now. We have here a an Ampharos Hollow from Dragon's Exalted and a Waylord. Wow, this is a really long trade, I love this. It's going to be awesome when I get to take loads of these reverses off from my uh, list. Hopefully that also means that I can update my website again. I'm very, very slack when it comes to updating my website. I just don't have enough time. Alright, we have a Sigilith from Dragons Exalted, um, an Ectric, rare reverse there. We also have a Garbador, Garbador, and that's just the one. Yeah. And here we have a nose pass. There's something else in there too. Whoops. And a sork. Nice stuff. Wow. Still some more to go. <laughs> Alright, we have a Yan Mega. Reverse. And I think that's it. We have a <laughs> this, is a, this is funny. Oh, it's a Tim Pole. Um, Dragon's Exalted. And there's something in there as well. <laughs> I'm, I'm hoping I'm not boring you guys because this is obviously not a booster pack opening, but it's still exciting. Alright, we've got Palpitone having a little wee. Uh, okay, and the last of the standard type reverses, except for the whole, sorry, the, the um, Registeel that I showed you, is Silcoon and Sveal. Finally, we have two cards, excellent cards to end up with. The first one is a ho EX from Dragon's Exalted, which I do need, never got the full art, never got that one, so that's fantastic. I really can't remember this trade. This is the funniest thing about trading over such a long period of time, like over a couple of months. You don't remember what you traded for, and this time I haven't actually recorded it properly, so... Um, but I trust her judgement. We've tra traded so many times. Um, next time I just I might just put something as a troll a troll card. Okay, and last card is a Superior from Dragon's Exalted, the Shiny, which I haven't gotten yet. Um, got the Rayquaza, obviously, as you guys know. Um, I think that's all I've got. I need to get the Shinies from next day, uh, Dark Explorers. I need the um, Golden Catcher. And I was looking forward to that one too. It's a trainer one. Um, and I think I'm looking for, I think I'm still looking for Next Destiny stuff as well. So, fun times ahead. But thank you very much, HB Dark. Very, very much indeed.
Okay, so moving on to the next package, or next two packages, what we've got here now is a package from Azir Brohi, I think that it's Postal Plus 2, I'm not too sure. Um, it's from the United States, but this is a mystery package, I'm not sure what's in here. Um, so I will open that up in a second. We've also got another one from Sam. Um, as, many of you, as many of you know, um, Sam is a very consistent and very dedicated fan who always seems to want to send something and I keep telling him not to but I guess he doesn't mind. But um, here's another one <laughs> and uh, we'll finish off the PO Box Friday with, with his, another package from him. I'm actually scared, I wonder what's inside this time. Anyway, let's open this mystery one. Um, quite intriguing. Normally people tell me if they're sending something, so I kind of have a vague idea, but sometimes people don't. Or maybe they did and I completely forgot and I have no idea. So um, this is one of them. Hopefully the note will say something. Alright, that's, that's done. Alright, so there's a note. Alright, it says here. Alright, oh, that's right, I remember now. Okay, so hey Pug Collection, haven't written a letter in a while. So, so let's see how it goes. I love your videos and being subscribed when Dragon's Exalted came when I got into car collecting. Welcome to the car collecting world. Um, well, I sent you some cards, obviously, and while I know you don't like it when uh, fans spend cash on cards, so I decided to spend time on them. Ha ha ha, well, yeah. I put the cards from Blah to, well, Blah? Well, the last cards are the ones I'm satisfied with. I hope you like the cards and keep the vids up. Cool Fish TV. Cool. Well, we do like creativity and we do like you guys not spending too much or at all on us. So, I wonder what. So, this is Blah, Eh, and Excellent. Okay. And an Amphros. Cool. Alright, so we'll start with Blah then. So, we have. Oh, cool! Cool Fish TV's got a Gigalith. I think that's a giggle. I think it is. Um, that's Cool Fish TV's Rock and Roller. <laughs> we got Cool Fish TV's Hop Hip and Jump Pluff. Excellent drawings. And wow, these are really cool. I like these. That's pretty cool. They should make cards like these, like little Pokemon in the back. So we got Electric and Timpole and the Manectric and Seismitoad. Oh yeah, of course, Baldor does evolve into Gigalith eventually. Why was I thinking it didn't? Alright, on to the eh with the weird face. Alright, so we have now a Bidoof with the barrel evolution down below. That's really cool. Uh, nose Pass and then Probo Pass. Cool. A Pom. Uh, and then Ambipom. Ordino. And then Ordino. <laughs> uh, Maractus and Maractus. Ball toy and Kaleidol. Vulpix and Ninetales. <laughs> a very casual looking, laid back uh, Slakoff and um, Slaking. Hey, this is really cool. I like these. I'm going to dedicate, I think, because I probably can fit nine nine cards on, on a page. I'm probably going to make it double sided and see how we go. Probably need more pages actually. Well, that would be nice to have a little area in my Poke Collection folder of awesomeness dedicated to all these really cool. Uh, Oops, and there goes the light. <laughs> That's why I shouldn't. Uh, hey, I weakened it like this light now. Oh, stop it. I'm speaking to a lamp. Malfunctioning lamp. Okay, anyway, carrying on. Oh, cool, so here we got a Feebas and a Malotic. I still don't understand how it evolves into that, but then Magikarp, how the hell did that evolve, in, evolve into Gaudos? But yeah, um, these are really cool. I can't even draw Stickmen. Okay, so we've got Wormpool and Beautifly. Got Drifloon and Driftblim. Got Ninkada and Ninjas. These are so cool. Gothita and Gothitelle. This is going to be really cool in my folder. I like this. Okay, we've got Yanma and Yanmega. we got Trubbish and Garbodor. we got Whelma and Waylord. Swablu and Altaria. We got Sveal and War Rain. Weasel and Floatzel. Magma and Magmorta. We've got Minchino and Chinchino. This is such good drawings. Golurk, sorry, Golet and Golurk. I really like these Pokemon, they're really cool. Agron and Aron. 
Mareep and Apple, very angry looking in Um uh, Oh cool, this is a um, Rufflet and Bravery. Oh cool, I really like this one, Cubone and Marowak. Wow, I don't know what you're saying about blah and eh, but these are all excellent to me. It's like a gigantic booster pack of awesome custom artwork, I love it. Very, very nice. I'm going to make sure I put these nicely in uh, in my... Um... Oh my goodness, there's a Gyarados in my uh, Poker Collection folder. <laughs> That's what I meant to say. That's really cool. That's going to go first, I think. Very, very nice. Love it. Well, thank you very much, um, Cool Fish TV, for sending us such a nice and thoughtful uh, little present there. It's really nice. I like that. I like I do like creativity and stuff as well. It's not really cool to look back on. All right, so moving on now to the final part of this very long PO Box Friday. Um, very very packed. We've got three packers, um, and yeah, we'll open up Sam Holloway's now. And <laughs> I'm slightly worried. <laughs> what has he sent us? Okay, so I don't know what to read. Okay, so note. I'm going to read note. We have a Shelder GLS with a moustache. Not sure what that is. Or GLS might mean gym leaders. Not sure. So we'll find out. Oh, cool. All right, so we've got a note here. It says here, "Hey, Pikachu, how are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. Hope you're recovering from surgery." No, that's spelled right. Well done. <laughs> um, I've oh, yeah, I've recovered from surgery. That's what I've been about a month. Now. So yeah, pretty good. Uh, it says, here are some cards, but don't worry, no EXs. When you replied back to me with the email and said trades are off for now, I said to myself, I think I'll just give them to you. Oh, jeez. Well, very nice of you, though. I shouldn't complain, I guess. Now I feel bad. <laughs> um, yeah, I can't really get to trades at the moment because it's just too too much work. But I will eventually. As I say, the uh, Wizard of the Coast card has no other cards in the sleeve. Be sure to check. Uh, P.S. Will you be getting Black and White 2 on DS? Yes, I've already got it. <laughs> I think people know now that I do. But yeah, definitely. Uh, pre -order, even if I didn't get it in advance, I would have got it. it. says, yeah, I pre-ordered it and you get a commemorative coin in Australia. So, hashtag bad ending. This ain't... Oh yeah, by the way... This ain't Twitter. All oh, right, yeah. Oh yeah. By the way, if you haven't guessed, it's Jim Leader Sam. Thinking about sending a plushie soon. Another plushie, or uh, we'll have to. I guess we need, wouldn't mind a cool new family member to this plushie family. All right. So, and of course, I haven't forgotten Jim Leader Sam. I remember your name now fully. <laughs> okay. So we have GLS Jim Leader. Oh, it's from my favourite set. Got Kabuto from Fossil. Ghastly. And Lapras, which is the rare. That was cool. That's very nice. Alright, so we got now a Thunderous Hollow from Emerging Powers. We got Sigilith Holographic from Dragons Exalted. We have a Rufflet Reverse. Nice. A Gabite Reverse. Actually I think what's funny is that I think I think um by the I think HP Dark has actually just satisfied all these um, reverse cards for me. Just how funny is that? Like two PO Box Fridays and one. Um, you got Jan Mega there. Um, and I have updated my website now, so that's good. We've got a Waylord um, Rare Reverse. Oh, cool. So we've got an Entei um, promo promotional card, number 34. Very, very cool. <laughs> awesome. we got a. We got Spinder and a V. This is from my little Spinder, well, from Spinder's diary entries on um, Facebook. Um, so it says, don't open this. Okay, don't worry. I will not. Very, very cool, Sam. Very nice indeed. Love it. Awesome, guys. Thank you to HB Dark. Thank you to Coolfish TV. And thank you to Jim Leader Sam for your awesome, awesome little packages. We'll see you guys very soon. Bye.